The neutrophil is a powerful and vigilant defender, constantly prowling the bloodstream in search of pathogenic invaders. When a target is encountered, it is swiftly engulfed and digested by the voracious scavenger. After a kill, the hunter does something unexpected. It casts a net to capture additional prey. Neutrophils are efficient assassins who expect to die, not reproduce. Their DNA is utilized as yet another weapon in their arsenal. When a pathogen is encountered, the neutrophil activates an enzyme, PAD4, to unpackage the tightly coiled chromosomal DNA into loose strands of sticky, web-like material. The nuclear contents are ejected from the neutrophil, forming a deadly net composed of DNA strands interconnected by histones and impregnated with lethal antimicrobial agents, including myeloperoxidase, neutrophil elastase, and defensins. The newly formed net is set, capturing and killing any invading bacteria unlucky enough to swim into its embrace. Once its mission is complete, the toxic net must be deactivated and destroyed. Serum nucleases chop the net DNA into smaller fragments that are easily ingested. Macrophages move into the area and dispose of the remaining net fragments, eliminating all traces of the pathogenic infection. Unfortunately, this defensive sword wields two edges. Failure to completely remove net fragments can result in the formation of autoantibodies directed against net components including DNA, histones, and PAD4. These autoantibodies can ultimately result in the development of autoimmune diseases, including systemic lupus erythematosus and rheumatoid arthritis.